Uh, it's Chris here for IFL MTK Global, and with me I've got WBO European Middleweight Champion Conrad Cummings. Welcome, Conrad. Uh, currently 12 1 and 1, getting into this fight. Uh, your last fight was against Norbert Sequeiras. Uh, you got a win on points, and that was also here in uh, Davnish. Um, tonight you're up against Michael Mora from Nicaragua. He's coming in 11 21 no. Uh, Michael fought against Podrick McCrory in his last outing in December. Uh, did you take much from that fight, uh, coming into the camp to prepare for this one? Uh, not really. I, to be honest, I haven't seen the fight. I was, the same, I was on the same bill, so I never had a chance to see the fight, but Podrick won one well. Uh, I don't really think much of that. I'm just focused on my job, getting the job done. Very confident to get the win and starting the year with a bang. Uh, your next fight is also going to be here in Belfast, uh, once again in the SSE Arena on 21st of April. Uh, it's been described as possibly the greatest fight card Ireland's ever seen and it's head by, headlined by your good friend Carl. Um, your opponent that night is going to be BUI Celtic middleweight champion Luke Keeler, uh, who also fights tonight in Danger in the Devonish due to reset reset of his last fight. Uh, will you have one eye on his performance tonight, whether it's through yourself or your coaches, to assess the strength and weaknesses going into the fight in April? Uh, well, I'll, I'll probably get to watch it myself because I was trying to fight myself. But uh, I'm sure either Jamie will take a wee look at it or I mean, my, my dad's going you know, to keep away in it. Just a wee bit of uh, Jamie's doing right and she's doing wrong. Still a wee bit of background information. But wish him all the best today. I'm sure he'll get a good win himself and set us up nicely for the SSU in April. Uh, although as a fighter you get on with your day job and you leave the politics of sport behind. Uh, but there's current, as an MTK stable fighter, what is your viewpoint upon the current situation with the ban in Republic of Ireland press? Uh, it's a complicated situation. Uh, I believe the MTK have done a good job. They've done a good job with myself and all their fighters. Uh, I think one of the best ones of names in Barton uh, at the minute. Uh, can't speak highly enough of all them. And uh, I'll just leave that there. <laughs> After this fight tonight, uh, are you going to be taking a week off to recuperate or are you going to go straight back into camp? Yeah, I'm doing camps in Manchester now. I've got a few things to do this week. I actually would have to stay back, but a couple of things to take care of at home. Uh, we'll be back out probably the following week, get cracked on, still take over at home this week and uh, crack on for April 21st. Uh, speaking of the camp, uh, you're over in Manchester and you're in great company with two other Northern Irish fighters and Stephen Ward and Carter Frampton. Great company, great company. Uh, <laughs> each is a character in their own, as we know. Um, who's the worst to live with? Uh, well, the f f I don't know. It's a complicated one. Uh, they both have good points and bad points. Uh, Charles always sort of... He's the bully boy, he came into the house, he put me in, there was two bedrooms, he put me into the bedroom and put me in the room with Stevie and for a while I was actually sharing the bedroom. So uh, he's the bully, bully of the house, uh, Stevie's good at making coffee in the morning there, so uh, both of the good points and the bad points, but uh, I'm the boss of the house now, so we'll leave it at that. <laughs> <laughs> Boxing's become much more uh, than just elements of training and fighting with the emergence of social media, sponsorship and investments. Uh, you've teamed up with Box Inc and you've now got your own training gear line. Um, where can you get this available and can you tell me more about where you're able to get your tickets for your April 21st fight? Well, uh, boxing gear now no, doing all my gear, doing a great job. Uh, my merchandise is available from boxing.co.uk on their website. It'll also be available in the coming days. It's actually available now, sorry, uh, from my personal website, conradcummings.co.uk, but that'll direct you to boxing.co.uk. Uh, uh, my fight in April, just contact me on, on Twitter, at John Cummings, or my Facebook page, uh, Conrad was the name of or Instagram. I get back to ASAP. Okay, Conrad, thanks for talking to AFL TV and wish you the very best in your upcoming fights.